We're all gonna get through this. We're all alive and we're all fine. And Britta, you're not the worst. You're the best. Britta! Is this about regionals? I just talked to Corey, and he needs you to be the Mouse King instead of me. Me? But I'm supposed to be a mute tree. It's an emergency. This will help us get to regionals. I knew it! Wait, where are the lyrics? They're in your heart, Britta. Right! We are everything! Christmas time! What? Oh, Britta's in this? No! Christmas. She's ruining it! Christmas time! Me so Christmas, me so oh, stop, merry! Stop, stop, stop! What are you doing? Get off the stage! I'm singing my heart song. Get off the stage and never sing again! You are the worst! Hey! You do not get to call Britta the worst. Yeah. Mr. Radisson, I think it's fine. Now, Greendale is an all-inclusive school. Why don't we let Britta sing her awkward song? Yeah! You're gonna throw a protest dance? Is that a thing? It is now. And instead of Sadie Hawkins, my dance will honor a real feminist icon, someone who worked for women's rights every day of the year, Sophie B. Hawkins. Oh. It was a really... You know what, Britta? You're right. A Sophie B. Hawkins dance is just what this school needs. Thanks, Jeff. To celebrate Sophie B. Hawkins and all her accomplishments. Jeez, Winger, who's throwing this dance, me or you? Um, Britta, I think you meant to say Susan B. Anthony, not Sophie B. Hawkins. Britta for the whoops! Didn't you have a cat named Susan B. Anthony? How'd you manage to Britta that? I didn't Britta anything. I meant Sophie B. Hawkins. Really? Your plan was to throw a dance honoring the singer of Damn, I Wish I Was Your Lover. And as it laid me down, which in my opinion is the far superior song. Ooh, that is a good song. Yeah. Yes. I am throwing a Sophie B. Hawkins dance. <gasps> and it is going to be amazing. And when people come, they're going to be like, Damn, she straight britted this. Because that's right, I'm taking it back. You're really doing this. Look, as someone who faked being a lawyer for seven years, I appreciate your commitment to the bit, but just admit you were wrong. So you can say I britted it? Yes, of course, that goes without saying. But come on, it was a small mistake. I call this off before it becomes a full-scale catastrophe. I coined that. Jeff, if you don't want to come to my dance, you are free to go to the Sadie Hawkins dance, which will be happening at the same time across the cafeteria. Our school has limited venue options. Oh, I wouldn't miss it. Oh, and uh, one last thing. You do realize that if you call it a Sophie B. Hawkins dance, people will expect Sophie B. Hawkins to actually be there, right? <laughs> yes. And when she comes, I'm gonna be like, I will remember you doubting me. That's a Sarah McLaughlin song. Happy Thanksgiving? You really you'd this one, huh? Yes, I meddled against your wishes. And yes, I got this address from the dean. But hey, you had a moment of doubt, and here I am to help you through it. Psychology tells us there are no accidents. Oh, really? What about car accidents, Tara Reed, or the Hindenburg? Here goes nothing. Hello, William. So, uh, how about we make a couple of ground rules? Actually, that sounds good. Okay, no hugs. Wouldn't want one, no apologies. Wouldn't accept one, no calling you dad. No expectations. No BS. Drink. Scotch. 18. Neat. I just want to acknowledge that there are a lot of emotions flowing right now, and you two are probably feeling a strong impulse to sleep with each other, and hey, that's normal. Well, I'll get the drinks. So, how about that? No muss, no fuss. Jeff, I urge you not to run from the muss and fuss. Hi. Hi. You must be my half-brother. <sighs> Hands are so much bigger than mine. Your nail beds are perfect. I can't do it. I can't. Oh, God. Oh, oh it's coming up. When I get upset, I vomit. Oh, I see you've met Willie Jr. You said he wasn't going to replace me. He's the Schwarzenegger. I'm the DeVito. I get it. 
Okay, fellas, let's get right into it. I think the big question on everyone's mind is, why don't I go help Willie Jr.? I have to plan in advance how to prove that I live in the moment. I mean, I'd rather take an actual class, but now it's too late to drop our ad. It is not fair how hard it is for you to cheat here. <gasps> hey, how's it going? How's your film class, buddy? It's cool. Our first assignment is a documentary. They're like real movies, but with ugly people. I'm learning a lot. That is so wonderful. Some people don't like getting involved in others' lives. I think it's great. Hey, if you're making a documentary about Britta patting herself on the back, you're gonna need a backup battery. Actually, I'm doing a movie about my dad. That is brilliant. How did he react to you signing up for the film class? That part hasn't happened yet. Here he comes. Hey! You want to get involved in my family's business? Holy war. Where do I find Mr. Britta? I'm Mr. Britta. That's right. I'm a woman with rights, and you can see my whole face. Oh, I get it, because I'm Arab. I must hate women. Let me tell you something. I love women, but I'm getting a major B-word vibe from you. Wow, I can't believe I missed out on getting involved in this. You go host American Idol, and you stop messing with my son. He's a special boy. I raise him, okay? You don't raise him. Raising him means letting him follow his dreams. Dreams are for sleeping. You don't know that. It's clinically proven. Stop polio. You lost me. Abed wants to study film. Anna, what does the have? Wait, what is he saying? He says we're leaving. Tell him that you want to stay and study film. I don't think I'm really in the scene. See, it was hard enough to talk to him before. Now we have this between us. Let's go. Hey, get, hey, let's, Jim, you, you I don't I, touch I, me. Stop stop. You, you don't touch me. Up, stop. Sir? You have a right to your faith and your family's privacy, but Abed is an adult and a U.S. citizen. Right? Yeah. And he has the right to stay. Fine. You want to raise him? You raise him. I'm out. Wait, what? You know, I had a father like you, and the day I finally cut myself loose is the day I finally started being happy. Well, that went well. I'll have to make some adjustments to my film. Jeff, I think you should play the role of my father. I don't want to be your father. It's perfect. You already know your lines. Britta, please tell me you're not using this app. I, I liked the idea at first, giving a voice to the unheard. But then Annie just told me that the rating system is exponentially weighted. As your ratings go up, your ratings of other people become more important. No. It just means the more others like you, the more likable you can make others. Makes sense to me. You know who else it made sense to? Say Hitler one more time, and I'm giving you a two. Jeff, are you not registered? The longer you wait, the harder it's going to be to get your number up. Annie! Listen to yourself. You're learning its language. You're letting a video game play you. I'm going to set these people straight. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Students of Greendale, we don't have to worship a calculator. There is no formula for people. Oh, you're punishing me for being alive. That's the general idea, baby. You're going to think I'm joking, but you were getting through to me more with mustard on your lip. Oh, shut up. He's not kidding, Britta. I thought I was imagining it. When you had mustard on your lip, I was more open to your opinion. Maybe it dilutes or distracts from your excessive intensity. Maybe it dilutes or distracts from your stupid butt. Mm. How you doing, Rod? Oh, don't be. Hey, Charlotte. I see what you did there. <laughs> Vicky! I love this. Shirley's a five. How? She's nice to people, Jeff. You know Shirley. Oh, Vicky, thank you. Did you just give me four meow meow beads? Uh, I love my four from Vicky. No. Stop it! I didn't mean it! <laughs> yeah, I do know Shirley. I'm going to help Shirley. Not a bad idea for you, Britta. She can make you a two again. Screw your twos and screw Meow Meow Beans. I know that's your one talking. What are you doing? Registering for Meow Meow Beans. I'm going to become a five and expose this thing for the sham it is. Oh, now you're speaking my language. That's unintentional, trust me. Mm -hmm. Let's make sure you know the real reason you're doing something or you'll fail before you start. It's actually a good point. It is? Why? 
went to her Facebook page, it says she was tear gassed and possibly beaten. I haven't been tear gassed in so long. Well, you're on a new path now. Oh, goody, a new path. Is it lined with credit cards and flat screen TVs? Does it go by an Ikea? Maybe I don't want a new path, or any path. Maybe my path is a war path that leads to the Terror Dome and words. Okay, maybe I went too far. Maybe I don't want to offend my African-American friends. But the larger point is, maybe I'm not done raging against the machine. Raging against the what? That sounds dangerous. Don't worry. She'll be bad at it. Keep clear of the can. Sir, step around the can. Mind the can, student. Oh, great. So much for bagels. So much for what? The bagels. You dropped them on the floor. Uh, they're called bagels. Uh, I lived in New York, Troy. I know what a bagel is. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you? What? You say bagel wrong. I say it the same as you. Let's say it again. Bagel. <laughs> <laughs> so, can we just keep studying? We're on page 258. Nana? Here's your switch. Bring it here. I'll make do. OK, let me have it. I ain't no nun. Bend over. Drop your pants and get over my lap. All you have to do is walk away. She's respecting her elders. See, Troy, did you think I was a hypocrite? That I wouldn't really... Okay, oh, that really... Oh, okay, that really... Oh. Ah. 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 I don't ah. understand you, Britta! Ah. I don't understand you at all! Ah. Ah. You know what? Totally wrong room. Can you get the door? Ah. Tell me that's not funny. Ah! Oh, oh, no. Wait! Here, Froggy, Froggy, Froggy. Here, Frog, Frog, Frog. Mr. Frog? Real quiet. Ah! 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 Culture gonna outgrow this wedding thing. You're anti wedding now? No, oh, she's just pro anti. No to everything you both said. Weddings are like little girls' tea parties, except the women are the stuffed animals, the men are making them talk, and they're not drinking tea. They're drinking antiquated gender roles. Somebody tell Britta what an analogy is. I know what it is. It's like a thought with another thought's hat on. Starburns was a good man. He barely sued me that time I ran over his foot. I say we honor Starburns by discussing him the same amount we did when he was alive. Jeff, have some respect. He might have been a 
scuzzy weirdo who shaved his sideburns into star shapes. Hi, May. It's Troy. Are you okay? Okay, good. I gotta go. This cost seven dollars. But he was also a classmate, a kind of sort of friend sometimes, and above all, a human being. He touched all our lives. Annie has a point. The death of a peer, especially at our age, can trigger a whole range of emotions. As a psychologist, Students. I hereby offer my licensed Unlicensed services as a grief counselor. Grief causer. If anyone needs to talk, the doctor Not even close. is in. Britta, I could use some help dealing with my grief. Great. Yeah. I was hoping you'd say that because I came prepared. You seem smarter than me when I met you. Thank you. For the purposes of this exercise, I am Starburns. Tell me the things you never got a chance to say to me. Come on, guys, you can ask me anything. What's heaven like? Uh, I don't know, glittery. Ask me something else. Have you seen Tim Russert? Guys, you were doing this wrong. Ask me something personal. Starburns, I didn't know you that well, but why did you smell exactly like salami? Abed. I got one. Where's my comb? I don't know. Yep, it's him. Why did you tape that switchblade to your ankle? Why did you always poop with the stall door open? Is it true you made out with Britta? I don't see how that's relevant. It was Fat Neil's blacklight party. Vicky saw you. If that's true, if, maybe, is because she was really drunk and she had just found out that her first boyfriend was getting married. If you guys are gonna do this wrong, then I'm gonna take these off. Ow. Okay, grief counseling is growing on me. Hi, I'm LeVar. Oh, I know. I was a huge fan of Rebop. It was canceled before I was born, but I scored some VHS copies. I was nostalgic from a very early age. Cool. Hey, you know, I assumed that Troy was a fan, but he hasn't said a word to me since I got here, and now I've got to catch this flight. No, I... no, you can't go. I, he loves you. He talks about you all the time. How much would it cost to change your flight till tomorrow? Is, um... $261 enough, because that's all I've got. That's all you've got? Yeah. <laughs> no, you you keep your money. I'll, I'll reschedule. Oh, my God, thank you. He's going to be so happy. You know, you are a very generous friend, but you're really stupid with your money. It's not that I'm selfish. It's just that I'm really stupid with my money, which is why I'll never have a lot of it and because I'm a really generous friend. Problem solved, dilemma deleted, Britta for the win? Oh, thank God he didn't take it. Could you imagine bouncing a check to Kunta Kinte? I think we just found our pizza getter. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. 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 Oh, like it matters who goes. Oh. 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 so funny. Karma. <laughs> That guy sucks harder than the toilet in an airplane bathroom. Airplane bathroom. Oh, my pies. Rocks and oh! you, you don't, don't have to point on the red light. Those days are over. You don't have to stay up into the night. Sing girls. Rocks I really love your place. You should move here. See what happens when I leave you alone, huh?